I'll tell you one thing. What a way to get going. And you're looking right here. One reason, Woo! it's a great reason to get up in the morning. Mm -hmm. From the WWF, Sonny, who is down to visit us for the show. We've had two great ones already, Sonny. Oh, it's just such an amazing morning of action. I can't get enough. We got more. That's Woo! why we've All got right. it. First, I want to say that everybody out there, please make a note of this. We're always testing your mental powers. Make a note of this one. Next Saturday, coming up at 1.30, out at the big one, I-240 in Hollywood, that's when wrestling action is going to be. It will be next Saturday afternoon. Again, an opportunity, particularly for the folks who live way out of town. It's a good chance for you to hop in, drive down. You'll be here. 1.30, the action will be in. You'll be over with and back home. And that one is a good way to have it. Next Saturday, oh, yeah. big one, I-240 in Hollywood. And let me tell you, you are going to love what's coming up. We're talking about opening up at 1.30 time with the first match, which will have the very part of the very team that was in here just a moment ago. The Truth Commission tank will be in there to face Stephen Dunn. And I'm sure that Stephen, after putting his partner Super Hysteria on, is going to want to do some nasty stuff to Tank. That will not be an easy job. Following that, Phil Dundee. The other half of that win by disqualification here today will be facing Truth Commission member Recon, the opening two matches. And then it's movie star Mike Samples, who's got a personal thing going with Bobby Bolton. If you weren't here last week, you uh, did not see Mike Samples interrupt a commercial shoot that Bobby Bolton had. And what happened on that situation, they'll be settling it out there at 1.30 at the big one when Mike Samples and Bobby Bolton get going. USWA tag title match. Nation of Domination, Wolfie D, J.C. Ice will be facing Billy Travis and Flash Flanagan, and that is going to be another one of those outstanding tag matches. A unified world heavyweight title match when Jerry the King Lawler will be defending against the King Pretender Reginald, who will be challenging. And then the final match of the day is going to be a USWA heavyweight title match when Too Sexy Brian Christopher will be defending against the Spellbinder. And we've got some things a little bit later on. You'll see why it has become very personal. All of that gets underway, Sonny, at 1.30 oh. out at the big one. And we are looking forward to a great Oh, trip. I hope I can make it. I hope I can get the day off from the World Wrestling Federation. Let me tell you one thing. That trumpet means that King Reginald, is, he was supposed to be out here at this time. Earlier in the show, he made his presence without any invitation. So here comes King Reginald with Queen. Lance, relax, brother. You're going to make your pacemaker act up. Relax, okay? Check it out. I'm relaxed. Hey, you know what? I am real mad. You, you know what I was in the back, man, watching the monitor. I was laughing. Jerry Lawler reminded me of the old Jerry Lawler. Jerry the loser Lawler. You see him laying flat on his back three minutes ago, didn't you? Yeah, I saw <laughs> He reminded me of the old king. You know what I mean? Uh, where did you come from? You jumped in here and got involved in the match. Don't be standing here and thinking we're dumb enough not to know that. Don't get your eye check, brother. That wasn't nothing to me. But anyway, check this out. Look, I got a title match with that fool coming up. They make it look. I had to pull up my throne in order to get a title match. You know what? Only thing I'm missing is that go around my waist, you understand? See, next two, three, four, five weeks from now, whenever it may be, I'm going to be sitting right there in that chair with the belt and my crown and this beautiful cape I got on. Oh, you got the cape, you got the crown, you don't have any belt, and you have, for the moment, a throne over here, but that's going to be up against that belt. All right, enough about me. What about Queen? What about this Queen? And let me say something. I know I smell something. It sounds like some New York garbage, you understand? Excuse me? Look, look, she ain't got no business out here. Look, we, look, we ain't fighting. Hey, you must don't know who I am. I don't know who who is? You almost don't know who I am. Oh, I don't know who you is? Look, First of all, learn some proper king. English. Look, I'm the new king. Queen is. I'll tell you what, baby. Look, this lady right here makes you look like a, a mud hole. It's so ugly stuff. Look, man, smart, you better real queen sit out here talking about that girl ain't got no business out here. No, what's, what's her name? Cloudy. Sonny. Oh, Sonny. You know better than hey, that. Queen, I'll tell you what, queen. Why don't you do me a favor, love? Why don't you take care of this low budget for me? Why don't you beat up one on out of here for me? Take care of her for me. Take I can take care of that, Queen. Hang on a second. That's the true Queen. Hang on a second. Hang on a second.
chicken. You think that she can come out here and be the queen of not only the USWA, but the World Wrestling Federation and every other wrestling company in the entire world? You think she can dethrone me as the first lady of professional wrestling, honey? I know. Hold on a second, Lincoln, Sonny. I know it. Baby, your days are long gone because the new queen is in town now. Hold on a second. I have been in with the best of them. I've been in the ring with Sherry Martell. I've been in the ring with Medusa Michelli. I've been in, ring, in the ring with more people than you can even name, honey. Yeah, but baby, you, you haven't came across Queen Nikki yet. Because I will pull out every strip of that bleach blonde hair, baby, and you won't know what hit you. You about to kick me off. Why don't you just take it all out of here? Nobody is I can take on any man in this building with one swift kick, and I'm still the queen of the World Wrestling Federation and all of professional. Baby, you probably did Peter take on every man, man, but I don't Peter need to take Peter on a man, Peter baby, Peter. because I will pop them falsies for you right now. Yeah. Okay, hey. We don't need any of that kind of conversation out here. Reggie, you're the one that got all this started. You know, this two-bit tramp is just like 7-Eleven, open all night, and I ain't got the time for you, honey. Hey, well, I'll tell you what I'm doing out here. Let me just say this. You see her standing here. I see you standing there. You look froggy. If you feel froggy, why don't you just jump on her? Go ahead. Huh? Well, come on. I can take care of her. No, no, let me tell you something. She don't scare Reggie. me one bit. Reginald. King let me Reginald. tell you something, Reggie B. Fine. King Reginald. When I get through with you next Saturday... You came out here, you pulled your little stunt a few minutes ago, but when I get through with you next Saturday, I will be sitting on that throne right there. I will still have the USWA and the Unified World title, and I will take that cheap 25-cent crown off of your head, and I'll send you right back to the projects that you came out of. You understand that, Reggie? Now, like I said, I think she's ready, willing, and able anytime you are. I tell you what, um, look, I got, I'm going to make a phone call. Come on, come on, baby. We're going to make a phone call. We're going to take care of her. I bet she don't make it back to New York. I See, there's one difference wow. here, Harry. There's one difference. She's got to walk around and strut whatever cheap stuff she has where I have the power of the brain and the power of the mouth, and I don't need to even be in the same room with her. Thanks for coming out, Joe. We're going to be back in just one moment. We've got more action for you. Lots of it.